So hey, um, it's Sam, obviously, in case you didn't recognize this, all this, uh, <laughs> I don't know what that was, um, so yeah, um, it is Tuesday, actually I'm lying, it's Monday, and I'm filming this on Monday because I have absolutely no time Tuesday, I barely have time today, so I'm lucky I'm able to even get this filmed, uh, excuse me, um, but this week's theme is... Ha, <laughs> just kidding. This week's theme is dreams and sleep and stuff like that. It's the little nap I was taking. Just kidding. Um, I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. So, yeah, it's um, quite convenient that this theme is this week because I, um, three of the past four nights have been rather insomniatic for me. Um, Thursday night I had trouble sleeping. Friday night was nice. Um, Saturday night I had trouble sleeping. And last night I had trouble sleeping. Um... Can't really, can't really tell you why, um, but yeah, so I'm hoping I can, um, get back on track with that soon. Oh, gosh, this lighting is killing me, literally. Well, not literally, like, I'm still alive, but it's, like, eating me. Like, look at, oh, I'm losing my face. Ah! Which brings me to dreams, because dreams can be surreal and terrifying, very much like this whole lighting ordeal. There was the dream one time when I saw a cross-dresser at Steak and Shake. Wait, no, never mind. That actually happened. Then, okay, oh, there was the dream where I bitch-slapped Ray with a cold, wet fish to the face, and then a bird pooped on him. Oh, wait. That wasn't a dream. That was more like a daydream. Just kidding. I just made that up. <laughs> but, okay, I don't know. I don't really dream, like, dreams that often. The most recent dream I can remember having was, alright, me and my friend, or rather my friend and I, were at this park downtown, and we were just chilling. There was some big festival ordeal going on, and that was fun. And then all of a sudden, Britney Spears comes up to us, and she's like, oh, you two are so nice. You're probably my favorite two backup dancers, and then walked away. And we were just like, oh, I didn't know we were backup dancers for Britney Spears. Then everything caught on fire, and we had to run home, and it was terrifying. That's my story. And that's all I got. I know it's another short but sweet one, but sometimes it's sometimes it's just better that way. Anyway, hopefully I'm gonna go sleep now. Actually, not now because I have to go to work, but hopefully sometime soon, please. Okay, bye. <laughs>